Are you guys ready for Noel? Yes. Yeah. Oh wait, I thought we were reacting to thick of it. No. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> wait, is it actually the backyard? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You, she doesn't know. You th wait. You're thinking about the backyard again when I say thick. Wait, the, about, about, you about. haven't heard? Wait, wait, they about, sing a about, song about, that's like. Nia, Nia, who made thick of it? I don't know what thick of it is. It's a song. But he who said made it? into the thick of it. So it was the backyard again. They were they were singing. E a. Right, and they hey, were chat, going... chat. Y'all heard it here first. Think of it was made by the backyard again. <laughs> <laughs> hey. You should make a, what's it called? Um, like a comment post on the channel right now and see what people say. Oh my god. And okay. if like by the end of the recording enough people say yeah, just like add it to the end of the video. Okay, 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 okay. Wait, but what is the actual name of the song? I think really it's called Think of It. It's not, I'm not even fucking <laughs> around. Like this? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna put his name in, in quotations. Not, no, put, no, put no, the no, 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 no. Put the, put the backyard again. Oh, yeah. the backyard again. Yeah. Is it the backyard again or backyard again? Uh, the the the. <laughs> no, but what? No, but no. Because the no, people no. are gonna get it because they didn't watch the video. They're oh, gonna yeah, actually okay, think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. We can put the backyard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, there we go. Okay. There we go. Oh my god, this is so dumb, dude. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna go vote right now. This is so stupid. Actually, I am gonna go vote right now as well. Uh, it's been a while. I'm not even gonna lie. So to recap, um, um, to recap, m mom basically told her daughter to either screw oh, the teacher. That's true. Yeah. 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 Mom, mom told her to sell her body. Um, Wild piece of shit, mother cause, man. Cause, uh. Yeah, yeah. Um, what else happened? Yule is like blackmailing her. Uh, he's being creepy. He's telling her to go steal from fucking Ivy, right? Honestly, she deserves to get stolen from. Fuck that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Ivy's mom oh, yeah. might be a murderer, and I think that's it, right? I remember that when that Abel was going off on a rant, and he was like, "What did you say?" He was like, "We live in a society, dude." And he found <laughs> out she might have to sell herself. We live in a society. <laughs> I hate going because, like, ah, you know, I'm not even joking. There's a time where, like. I was that guy where like every, you couldn't get I, I couldn't start a song conversation without saying we live in a society where <laughs> blah, 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 blah. and so whenever I say that now I kind of cringe and I try to step away from it but like <laughs> shit like bro but that was the time to use that that was the that was that a very was perfect a time, time to was, use it, I would yeah, I would not be able to yeah nowhere else nowhere now say hey he says shit ah morning you're awful thank oh. you you're no catch yourself Ooh, oh, oh, yeah, oh, okay. the lip bite too. Okay, mm. all right, Noel. I think Noel might be a little wait, too wait, tiny wait, for let, this let, big let motherfucker, see. but you know. <clears throat> Hold on. Oh. Ah, dude. After what that mom said, I don't want even. I don't like those jokes no more. <laughs> I don't like those jokes after that. After what the mom said. Abel is a changed person. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wait, let me see that shit again. Hold on. Yeah. <clears throat> Thank you. You're no catch yourself. Okay, Abel, would that fold you, Abel? Would that fold you? Her giving you that look? Ah, fuck. Oh, Are you God. sick? Don't call me sick. I want the disease. No, no. I'm just tired. If so, get the snowflakes. Final trial starts. Um, actually, since I didn't get much sleep, I don't think I learned those snowflakes yet. Hmm. I think I'll just practice the easy ones today. That is fine. But I can't pay you yet. Even if it's felt, you feel clothes. About that, I'm not so sure I get it. Your what? Money? Yes, you don't. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> fucking <okay>. do. <laughs> <laughs> You're overseeing my snowflakes, so you know they're of passable quality. The only thing is, oh, the only thing missing is the official license. So why can't I get paid? No license, no pay. But you'll be paying me for this same exact thing once I do have the license. Ooh, okay. So. You know, I guess she's she's locking in now. After realizing everything, she's like, "Damn, I gotta, I have to play this dirty." She's trying to scam him from the snowflakes. Yeah. Yes. Can't you make an exception for me until I get until I do get it? No special conditions. Gets confusing and illegal and annoying. That is kind of that's kind of respectful. Yeah, that shit does get annoying. Abel, would you give Noel a, a special condition? I wouldn't like. I, I mean, like, I'd do a loophole, you know, because I'm I'm, per, I'm really proficient in finding loopholes. But <laughs> aside from that, no, I I wouldn't. Uh, I I wouldn't do anything legal per se. Uh, yeah. 
Uh, sure. Okay. You get your license soon. Hold on, only a little more. It's just that there was this little catastrophe at home. Crime won't help you. Life is hard, Noel. You need grit. This nigga, bro. Okay, yeah, life's hard. But, like, <laughs> a little harder for her, man. With grit, you can get through even the gray stones. Grit or not, Noel makes low level snowflakes all day long. Poor little pipsqueak. For free. Unfortunately, as promised. Bro, this guy's not even, like, teaching her anything. <laughs> like, <laughs> isn't the point of an apprentice to, like, you know. To teach? I mean, yeah. yeah. Like, hey, so this is how you do it. But, like, guess bro, not. just give her a template and that's it. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, as promised, Yule is waiting for her after she clocks out. Aw, look at your eyes light up at the sight of me. Let's get this over with. I've devised thus a simple little plan to get around Ivy's defenses. Even you should be able to do it. Alright, hit me. Can I really? <laughs> Yule raises his hand, hopeful. <laughs> oh! <laughs> what are you guys' thoughts on that? That's crazy. What if he's just fucking Like, around? it's a joke. And maybe he's a maybe I mean, he's an equal and... rights kind of guy. You know? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! She's actually scared too. I mean, yeah, some random thug says, "Hey." As in, clue me in on the plan, goddamn you! Oh, never mind. She does that grit to her. <laughs> oh well, maybe next time, huh? Let's go to your place. You're going to need some pen and paper. <laughs> does she even have pen and paper? Mother is home, <laughs> hurting the kids. Oh. Oh, who's this? Oh, they're meeting. Okay. Um, well... A fellow apprentice. I hope you don't mind us doing some study. He sure lies fast. Because... <laughs> because we're doing it anyway. What do you think she's thinking, the mom? She's like, oh... She, she probably hopes he's rich. <laughs> yeah. And she looks like she'd be like... Please you be got rich. money, Please boy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he has money. Wait, when he says because we're doing it anyway, what does that mean? No, no. Yeah. Like, oh, he gets to get gonna... it? Look, look, he's saying... That I hope you, the mom, don't mind us doing some studying. Oh. Because we're doing it anyway, no matter what you say. Okay, okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Dude, he's a fucking asshole. <laughs> I don't fuck with bitches like him, bro. <laughs> I mean, this nigga walked in. That's kind of crazy. He just be walking in people's houses and talking like that shit. Yeah. Yeah. Shut up, nigga, bro. <laughs> you can't tell he's a fucking imp. <laughs> That's <what he> <laughs> That is racist! <laughs> no, can... it's not! That sounded like. <laughs> it sounded like you honestly just called him the hard R. Yeah, that kind of sounded racist, bro. No, <laughs> you did tell it, he's bro. an <laughs> Nia's really, you know, digging into Noel's personality here. Looking. Yeah. No, no, not at all. Feel free to use the kitchen. Not like there's any food in the kitchen. She vanishes somewhere, but the amount of noise in the house doesn't lessen at all. The kids are playing and squealing about something or another. It's <laughs> it's all clearly irritating Yule, and that makes Noel happy. So what's the plan? You're writing our uh, you're writing Ivy a heartfelt, groveling apology letter. She's not gonna read it. Noel sits down to write it anyway. <laughs> Nothing comes to mind, at least anything she hasn't already said. I feel like I'm just picking another fight at this point. Dear Ivy, I've reflected upon our last conversation and want to apologize. Yeah. Noelle rolls her eyes. I don't though, I still stand by what I said. Write it. This poor girl, bro. Yeah. Begrudgingly, she does as she's told. Oh, shit. I understand now how selfish I was and how thoughtless. She's selfish and thoughtless too. I'm doing all this for my family while- No one cares, just write it. Making snowflakes isn't the same without you. I just want our friendship back, though I understand if you don't. Your pen isn't moving, Noel. But what are your thoughts on this guy? This is the type of nigga to try to get a means to an end. Oh my bad word, I blurred out the n-word. But um, he's what? the type of guy to try to get the means to an end. You know what I'm saying? He wants to get from point A to point B and he does not care. All right, he's a bit of a- that's true. A whack job. That's you know? true, but uh, you, you can say the N word about <laughs> I mean, I'm trying to curse less, you know what I'm saying? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Like for the channel? Yeah, but uh, oh no, just overall in life. Like, uh, you know oh, what I'm okay. saying? It's kind of getting bad when I'm like, okay, I can't okay. go like five minutes without saying the N word at school, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of getting bad. Okay, okay, okay. I'm, I'm a grown ass man who can't control like using the slurs. Yeah, yeah. Once you reach like. I was gonna say, I was gonna say, I agree, I need to stop cursing but then abel brought up the n-word and i was like no i need to shut my mouth 
Uh, chat Nia says the n-word all the time off uh, off camera. Okay, no, I no, I do not. That's yeah, that you're spreading misinformation. Well, the thing is, I don't know. Wait, what? <laughs> Nemle, <laughs> Nemle, you could tell we could tell you're Finnish, Nemle. We could tell. <laughs> I don't know. If do there, I, I want it back? Wait, right. I don't know if I do want it back. Dude, Nemle fucked up here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's that's, that's, that's some cooked shit right there. Yeah, she she, she not cooked. She was. Yeah, she all, you know, she was she was cooked when she wrote that nigga. She was like pulling it on. <laughs> she was looking her. like a, like Noel's mom. <laughs> Pretty much, and she was like, "Oh, you just yeah. got it. You're the lines. Oh." Or I mean, I do, but not if it means kowtow. Wait, what? Kowtowing? Uh, probably. Kowtowing to her completely batshit standards. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that means. <laughs> kowtowing. Right. Like, oh, what? Yeah, she's right. Like, if, like, if she what? had a miscarriage, if she had a, like, if she had a miscarriage, she'd expect me to get an abortion. Oh wait. Oh, okay, 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 I get it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I That's get funny. the analogy. That's funny. Yeah, bro, Yule does not care about this, bro. <laughs> Look at his face. He does not care. He just wants that letter. Oh shit! If it's babies you want, I'll fill you up later. Just write the damn letter already. There's no. Oh my god. Oh so wait, Nia, were you stun locked? <laughs> Yes! <laughs> I mean, really said, I'll fill you up later. Like, it's a fucking. Like, he's like a refill over at Starbucks. Like, she's a fucking <laughs> donut or some shit. Like, uh, no! <laughs> <laughs> like, she's a donut. <laughs> That's insane, yeah. That's crazy. That's if it's baby, crazy you want, I'll and fill disgusting. You up later. Just write the damn letter already. It's been a while, but since I've been to Krispy Kreme. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think this is gonna work? That type of riz? No. What? That's I police hope it shit. I hope it doesn't. What? No. <laughs> Bro, let me read. <laughs> what? No. That was just an example. Write the letter, Noel. But it's not what I want to say. Do you honestly think this has anything to do with that? Yes, nigga. She's not that bright. <laughs> That's fucked up, Abel. Look I'm at her. Yeah, like, we weren't as good on her side of the neighborhood. How can you call her dumb, Abel? Look at her face. I mean, yeah, like deers are cute, but like they're fucking dumb as shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's true. All I need is you inside that house. You're going to write whatever it takes to achieve that. Screw your friendship. Oh. Right. Now, right. You will compose this the sappiest apology letter. Noel doesn't agree with any of it, but she writes it all down and then heads off to deliver the letter. Standing in front of their mailbox, Noel hesitates. I think I should rewrite it after all. Fascinating. Yule snatches the letter from her and drops it in the mailbox. There. You're welcome. She'll read that and know I didn't mean any of it. If anything, my fake apology is only going to make her angrier. I doubt that. Now, when she gets in touch with you, you will reiterate what we wrote. Ugh. Yes, you will. And there won't be a single excuse or but I at what? And there won't be a single excuse or but I added. Am I a monkey? Do you guys know what he's trying to say there? Yeah. You're just yeah. a monkey. I'm a monkey. All right. Yeah. Uh, we'll reiterate what we wrote. And there won't be a single excuse or but I... Okay. 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 I am a monkey. My bad, guys. My bad. <laughs> My bad. Fine. But I think it's not going to work. She's going to come to you. But since your house is such a pleasant place right now, you'll relocate to hers. And if you come out of that house without at least one sphere... You are not getting your license. Do you understand? Yeah. I said, do you understand? Yes. Great. Now good be a ugh, now go be a good girl at home and wait. Maybe cut some onions to get the tears rolling. Like I can afford any onions right now. That is so crazy, bro. <laughs> That's so crazy. No money for onions. You s and you seem so confident this is going to work. Am I supposed to believe a teenage girl's mind is somehow more complicated than this? She's 20. Ivy's 20. Whatever. Go home before I drag you there by the hair. Oh, the fuck up. Hell, hell. 20. I liked you better when you were pretending to be nice. What about? 20. Huh. That's Ivy police 20, shit. Not Noel. No, 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 no. But that's some police shit. They gotta 20. be like the same age, though. Yeah, they're, they're, that means they're both 20. Yeah. I should. Wow, brother. That's a sad line, though. I liked you better when you were pretending to be nice. Mm. Aww, poor Noel. Why don't you go home for now? You must be tired. I am, and I will. She's putting up with a lot of his shit. 
Like, that's kind of crazy. Bro, when you're, I mean, in her freaking uh, I understand, you know, life, like, like, she gotta be fucking resilient, bro. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, like, she's like, she's going along with what he says too much, you know? Like, I would have told him to fuck off, like. Dude, honestly. oh yeah, and you're gonna go prostitute I mean, yourself? Yeah. Yeah, she gotta feed her freaking siblings, bro. Yeah, like, man, I don't nigga. know, man. I'd rather be a murderer than, than a prostitute. Like, I'll go kill people first. Nigga, you think, no, you don't know what kind of world they live in. They could just be like, oh, kill, it'd be cheaper to like, I don't know, kill chickens than to kill people or some shit. You don't know what kind of world she lives in. I don't think there's too many kitchens. I mean, oh, you think, oh, chickens. oh, wait, oh, wait, you mean like robbing niggas? You know, that makes sense. Just don't get angry at me when this doesn't go the way you think. Let me worry about that. I'll drop by later. Wonderful. Can you not make it the middle of the night this time? I would be asking for money. <laughs> Straight up. Yeah, just be like, yeah, yeah just be like. <laughs> Yule doesn't deem Noel worth responding to, nor saying goodbye to, for that matter. He just walks away without sparing Noel as much as, of his, uh, as much as a glance. What's with the attitude? Aren't I doing you a favor right now? Though her own attitude wasn't any better. She goes home, thinking of all the things she wrote to Ivy. It's just not right. Why do I always have to be the one to apologize anyway? Later that evening, there's a loud knocking at the door. Please don't be Yule. It's not, it's Ivy. Noelle opens the door, already done with this crap. But the one standing outside is Ivy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like that face. Make that say the thumbnail, nigga. That's just funny. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, that's a funny thumbnail. She's holding Noelle's letter in her hands, in a state Noelle has never seen her before. Aww. Aw, the letter, the letter made her think, like, probably made her think about herself. Oh wait, I'm Ivy, oh, yeah, fuck, you're it's Ivy. been a while. Ivy, <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. I know it's been like two weeks since the last session, but like... I, I got your letter. Oh, oh crap. <laughs> Noelle! <laughs> <laughs> she leaps into Noelle's arms. Oh, crap. It actually worked. It is not that she isn't happy to see Ivy. She's just upset that Yule was right. Damn. I mean, she is a fucking NPC. Ivy? Ah, all of them. All, all of them. them. <laughs> if she's upset now, she'd have no excuse not to carry on with this plan. Oh! <laughs> I didn't think you'd ever get, ever get it, you blockhead. Oh, my God. I was wrong. I was wrong. I thought the letter made her feel bad, but... <laughs> Yeah, oh, she's a demon. She's on. I was about to say that now, uh, this girl Noelle would be kind of like the bad friend mm -hmm. because she fake apologized and now they're gonna be like all good now. Mm -hmm. But fuck no, Ivy's still the same bitch she was. Bro. <laughs> uh, no, she's a she's a terrible person. I'm so glad you finally came around. I was. Ivy looks at the mess that is their kitchen. Hold up, what happened here? Noelle pauses. She can already see how this is going to look. Oh! What if she thinks she's only apologizing because they need, like, financial help? Mm. Yeah. yeah. Mm, that might happen. I don't think she would. I don't know. Noelle's bringing it up first, in her mind at least. Ivy is going to think Noelle's begging her for forgiveness simply because she needs money. She's never asked for money. That's true. That's true. All, like, the, all, the only thing she does is, uh, like, eat out at her place. At least that we know of. I don't, yeah. It hasn't brought up if like she's asked for money in the past. Even so, Noelle doesn't want to lie to Ivy. No. Part of her is still hoping this relationship can be put back together. No. So if nothing else, she wants to give Ivy the opportunity to decide for herself what to make of Noelle. Do you really want to know? Of course. What is it? Our pipes were so old that they burst open after some water froze inside them last night. Huh? How is that possible? I'm pretty sure someone did it on purpose, though I have no proof. Okay, she's telling her, like, most of the truth. She's just mm. not bringing up Yule. Like, with an ice spell or something? But who could have done that? There's only a handful of people around who can use magic. There's this guy who's been up on my case lately. He's not from here. Okay. Master Yodelin? I mean, he is powerful, but... No, no. This, um, other guy. I don't really know anything about him. He just showed up the other day. Ivy looks concerned. Ah, uh, okay. So... Noelle tells Ivy about Yule... Fucking retard. How he showed up and helped her with the snowflakes. And how he wants Noelle to steal from Ivy. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. 
I'm kind of happy. This is what I would have done. But that's just me. I know. It's, it's going to fuck her over. But she doesn't say a word about the apology letter being a load of bull. Oh, but Yule could expose her in turn. Mm. And say that the, the apology was bullshit. Mm, this is not good. What on earth? What does he want with those spears? Is it spears? He said they're his. Well, they're not. They're from something my mom has to keep an imp sealed off. Mm, imp. They don't even have any monetary value. Oh. Huh. Oh, no, that's you. <laughs> huh. What do you think I should do? Tell them to get lost? Well, yeah, but... But what? I can't get this job without him. Oh! Noelle, you're not getting this job regardless. <laughs> Noelle knows it's this true. This girl. <laughs> Noelle knows it's true, dude. <laughs> that sucks, man. No, it's fraud. You're out. I need the money, Ivy. You'll be fine. You've always made enough somehow. <laughs> that was before our kitchen needed to be repaired. It's okay. You'll figure something out. What kind of piece of shit person she is? <laughs> I, I, I would have killed her. I, I, I would have crashed out and killed her. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I would have killed her. Dude, I, I would have crashed out. I'd be like, after like my mom's... Dude, if she tells her her mom told her to go prostitute herself, and she's like... All right, you need to make some money somehow, bitch. Oh, <laughs> oh, I would, I would actually murder her. I, yeah, I, I don't well, think I, I, I didn't didn't. know any of that though. She doesn't know that, you know. Uh, yeah, know, I like, feel like she would. To, like let that shit out on her, bro. She needs to understand, bro. I mean, need some fucking empathy, bro. You know, I just like you, know, bro. Oh my god, there's like a like a there's like a little bit of rage that she's just incurring. It's insane, man. <laughs> it's it's insane. Are you? Wait, what? Are uh you gonna help me pay it? Haha, <laughs> you know I don't have any money. That's my parents. Oh my god. Honestly, it's your mom that should pay for the renovations anyway. Holy fuck, I go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Give up, this is why I don't fuck with rich people, bro. Uh, but, but keep in mind, we, we don't know how much Ivy knows, you know? Like, but it's Dale, bro. Like, she walks Ivy into doesn't the house. Know that, you that... think the house looks nice? <laughs> Do you question. think they have more than a single chair in that house? Like, holy fuck, like, if I, dude, I don't think you understand, like, ah, bro, if, ah, nigga, oh my god, bro, the entitlement, it has money, it's my parents, <laughs> I'm like, yeah, it, it's, yeah, just cause your parents, yeah, your parents have money, mine doesn't, we don't have money, you know, like, I'm dealing with, uh, 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 uh you know what I'm saying, I'm dying, Damn. I'm dying, I'm Rich dying people from make <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, they're about to make me literally go Robin Hood on their ass. Ugh. Honestly. I feel like Noelle should mom just tell Ivy her. everything. You read it already. Yeah. yeah. Like, no, I, okay. uh, Noelle should tell, like, Ivy, like, hey, my mom has literally prostituted herself in the past. I don't know. I feel like yeah. Ivy needs, like, a little wake-up call. Yeah. She doesn't have the money either. Well, anyway, oh. it'll be fine. Oh. Somehow. <laughs> Somehow, guys, it'll all be Yo, fine. Yo, bro, dude. I'm a sort of guy. If Rick Sanchez really is real i'm gonna ask that nigga to give me his portal gun right now i'm going to the universe and i'm beating the fuck out of this bitch <laughs> it's actually insane i've never wanted somebody to experience slow pain no way no way oh but, but there is a right answer to this by the way uh who's worse ivy or yule ivy nia what is your answer to that uh yule okay uh it's about, it's yule about it's yule Yule. Like yes. Ivy's Ivy's only like this because she was raised rich and she's never had to experience oh, Ivy's pain just pain or problems or anything. Oh, you know, you know, you know what makes me so happy? Yule you know is what a makes thug. Me, she a 20 year old. Yule she is, is a 20 year old. She is a 20 year old motherfucking woman, nigga. I knew this shit when I was literally 14, my nigga. I was. Yeah, Abel, because people like us grow up differently. This bitch is probably I the most don't. privileged bitch in the whole fucking town. Abel, she's not gonna understand. I don't. People grow up differently. And you can't I, dude, compare I, dude, dude, dude. an actual so what thug, no, 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 a thug, no, 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 no. a dangerous thug, to some fucking twenty-year-old teenager. <laughs> Actually, twenty-year-old. No, 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 no. I, I the the problem I mean. with this, the problem with this, okay. is that if they were friends, maybe like for the past year, or they just met each other, understand it. We're right. We can make this argument. But the fact that she's been poor her whole life, and she know they've been friends since they were kids. They, she know, she. The, it's been it's literally it's been right in front of her face she's just decided not to see it she's she's literally seen all of this exactly she's literally no no she's in no 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 she's not she, there, there's there's blissful ignorance and then there's just choosing to be stupid you're choosing to ignore it she is choosing to ignore the, the problems that that she's having she's I don't saying know, bro. I don't know. she's chose she has chosen I, this mentality i think ivy I, is a is a believable character i i think 
No, I think somebody no. can be that ignorant. 100. percent Okay, 100%. wait, but but someone but can be that ignorant. That's not the thing. It's someone to be, but you have to blissfully choose to be ignorant. ignorant. Blissfully, you're not. Ignorant. She's she yes, I believe a 20 year old girl ignorant. can be that blissfully ignorant. I do believe that about. No, that is no, that is no, that is not. It, that's no, that's no. She's a lot of things, but she's not blissfully ignorant. Dude, people are fucking stupid, and people are selfish. <laughs> she's one of them. No, no, no. People are selfish. You're damn she, right. But she's no. Dude, uh, she doesn't give a shit about anybody but herself, probably. I don't think you understand. Oh my god, bro. Jesus Christ. I, I think but comparing I, her and, to Yule is like kind of crazy. Like, like Yule is something. Yule else. is Yule literally. Is type of, he like, he picks this girl who's struggling to feed herself and her siblings to look, have her do his dirty work. He needs to get his dirty work. Okay, I don't think you understand. Yule's coming over. He's like, all right, I need to get my things. All right, these are mine okay i need to get my things from this lady's house mm -hmm. all right actually, actually, and he's seeing if he sees no well, he we'll sees see no well and he's seeing we'll see about that we'll see about I, well, that i do believe that ivy's mother is probably like an imp hunter or some shit yeah. uh we don't know for sure and also like yule does seem like a fucking asshole you know so like he could be lying but that, we just have could to be lying story to see yeah but like from Should so far he? he's just trying to get a means to and he needs to do x y and z that's literally it and he, she's like fucking it over you know what I'm saying? He, oh, what the fuck? Yeah, he's just trying to do. He's just trying to get that shit over with. You know, and it's a means to end. It's nothing personal, sweetheart. He don't give a fuck about the emotions. You know what I'm saying? But he doesn't give a fuck about the emotions. You know, he doesn't care. But he—that's the thing. He doesn't care. Wow. What's the fucking? What's her face? Snake bitch. Ivy. Okay. She's like um. <laughs> well, Ivy's just like she. She. She doesn't care, even though she knows that she should care. When she should care, she doesn't care. It's like it's two different types of not caring, you know what I'm saying? Like it's like I, I see what you mean, Devel. I, I get your point, yeah. but the thing is, I do believe people can be like Ivy, 100. percent Ah, no, 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 no. You're saying be like Ivy. Well. You're, you know, you're putting this narration, you're putting this like thing that this is what Ivy is, and we're disagreeing on what Ivy is specifically. I'm not saying you believe that somebody's just completely blissfully ignorant like Ivy, and I'm like saying no. Ivy is not blissfully blissfully ignorant. She's choosing to be stupid. She's choosing to ignore what is the reality you know in what? front of her. Yeah, and that I'm kind is of agreeing with the bell now because being like a bad because I I'd say Yule is a bad person, but Ivy's ignorance doesn't just make her an ignorant person. She's also a bad person. Being ignorant, being willingly ignorant, doesn't just make you an uneducated and like you know like it, it does make you a bad person. Yeah, because she's like, not so ten anymore. Can, she's, yeah, yeah. She, yeah, yeah, she is a grown woman, and she has seen this before. This is not the first time she's walked into Noelle's house. Yeah, at this she, point, she, she's willingly being a bad person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's. It's like, to what extent does ignorant? Like, to what extent can we say like, oh, she's just ignorant? And yeah, self like she's been ignorant and, you know, far too long. Like, yeah, she's been. Yeah, she's at this point. You're just choosing to be blind. If you're like, uh -huh. if she's like 50 years old, are you still going to be like, you know what? I still feel like people can be this ignorant and just give it a pass. Like, no. Like, no. It's like, you know what I'm okay, saying? Okay, okay, okay. Here's the, here's the point of disagreement, right? I'm not saying Ivy's not a bad person, right? Mm -hmm. I'm saying Yule's worse. Significantly worse. That's what I'm saying. So, okay, let's ask this question. Mm -hmm. Who would you rather Why have though? in your life? Yule or would you rather have Ivy? Because... Who would you want in your life? Would you, rather, would you want to have a Yule or would you rather have an Ivy? Let's see, a thug or a rich 20 year old girl? Hmm, I, I really wonder. I really wonder which one. A rich, no, 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 no. She's not rich. No, 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 no. She's not rich. She's not rich. Her parents have money. Her parents have money, all right? So she ain't rich. She's just a 20 year old girl that doesn't give a fuck about how you feel about uh, your financial situations. When my niggas are going through a tough time, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, hey, nigga, I'm going to help you out, all right? If I found out, like, my nigga needs X, Y, Z, if my nigga needs this, my nigga needs that, I I'm like, my nigga, I got you. You need money for gas, I got you. You need money for food, I got you, my nigga. Yeah, you know? I'm and not that's what they've done to me. The yeah, and it's like, you got you, who's a thug ass nigga. But <laughs> he understands, he's like, all right, you need this, so I'm gonna give you this if you give me that. All right? It was like, mm -hmm. no feelings involved. This is just business, sweetheart. All right. And Cause I don't dude, need... imagine having a friend that is obviously financially well off when in your whole life you have been struggling to get your meals in every single day and you get to the point when you need something and this girl is so blatantly selfish that she decides to ignore all of your needs just because she wants your fucking job. She's a greedy ass bitch. <laughs> and you will, he is a thug. And you know what? Some people are thugs and he's yeah. not a good person either, but, but that's all he is.
Yeah, that's you know? it. He's just yeah. It's like he ain't yeah. fun. He's done. Like the thing is, he's and he's done what he's in. He's like, you know oh what? I'll get God. you more. He said, I'll get you this pass. Like he he made those first snow flakes, and he said, if you just do this for me, I'll give you this this pass. You can start making money. Good, good, good. We can help. I can help you cook. Mm -hmm. he, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And he's yeah. like, if you let me cook. If you let me cook, I can help you cook, and then we can just cook by ourselves <laughs> alone, away from each other. Okay. And I'm like, yeah. that okay. makes sense. I still, I still yeah. think, in the grand scheme of things, right? Yeah, maybe to Noel, uh, Ivy's probably worse. But in like in the grand scheme of things, looking as an outsider, right, not as anybody in the story, Yule is a worse person, in my <sighs> opinion. In my opinion, maybe uh, Ivy's, Ivy's, you know, she's young and she's done, you know. But that's it. Yeah, you're gonna say that she's young and dumb when she's 32, huh? <laughs> but she's not 32, though. <laughs> well, she's 20. Okay. Yeah, but when she's 30, different. you're gonna. And you really uh, think that when she turns 30, she's gonna be any different? That's the thing. Yeah. We don't know. The, the, we can't possibly predict that because that's a whole 12 years of life experience, and we don't know what's gonna happen. I'm just saying, in the moment, mm -hmm. currently. And we and we, and we have 20 years of life. She's just dumb. And we've already seen the first 20 years, 20 years of life experience. Not much is gonna change. That's Clearly. not true. That is not true at all, though. That, that is, is 20 so years true. experience. Somebody could be a, a completely different person at 20 than they are at 30. Or even fucking 20 and 22. Like, people can change like that. Okay, I won't deny that people can change, but it's like, Dude, I don't see her don't on know. any trajectory to change. Like, after, like, just during this conversation. No, but that's the thing. Like, it doesn't have... matter if you don't see her on a trajectory to change, because you never know what the hell is going to happen in the future. Mm. Is it crazy to think that if after 20 years of living, you're not a good person, there's something wrong with you? Ah, like experiencing no, 20 no. years alive as a grown person and you're not a good person, you're still like a shitty ass person. Like, I think there's something wrong with you. Like when I meet people like that, I think there's something wrong with you. Like how have you existed for 20 years and not have a basic sense of empathy, you know? Oh, a basic sense of, okay, empathy. Okay, that's, yeah. Or just okay, being okay, freaking nice, bro. Some people are just literal assholes, bro. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. If you can, just be, like, nice, period. Like, there's and something like, wrong with you at, at all. There, yes, I can agree that there's something wrong with you. You know what I'm saying? If you're just, like, if somebody makes the occasional whoopsie or does something wrong or is, like, or just, like, does something bad or whatever, I'm gonna be, like, eh, redemption type shit, you know? But it's, like, if you literally show nothing on how to, be like, if you just, if you just exhibit no redeeming qualities and you've been, been alive for 20 years... I'm surprised you made it even to 20 years. You know what I'm saying? Like, and you know you, what? I'd even go as far as to say that if it takes a life-changing event to make you a good person, still, there's something wrong with you. You know like, what? That's Maybe. crazy. That is one step. That is one step. But um, can I see yeah, myself it's, making it's a that step, step? It's a step in the right direction. But like, I don't know, dude. People are people yeah. are crazy. Yeah. We live I in a society. We live in a society. Nice way to end that off. <laughs> We live in a society, guys. That's the takeaway. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright. Noel, I mean... Noel! Yeah. <laughs> oh, have I not read this? <laughs> oh my <laughs> god! Bro, somebody oh called me Nopales, bro. <laughs> Dude, somebody called you Miami. Like, <laughs> it's ridiculous at this point. That Miami doesn't bro. even start to end. Maybe telling her was a bad idea after all. Tomorrow, you will tell Master Yodelin that you can make... You can't make those slow... You can't make the snowflakes. And then step down from being his apprentice. Oh my god. Huh? Why do I need to step down? He could still teach me. You can't afford it though. You have to make money. That's true. Yes, so tell him the truth and we'll figure out something together. Okay. Bro, you know like Yule's like hearing all this somehow. You just know he is. Yeah. Come over tomorrow after quitting. This is crazy. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> just like demanding her around like this. I'll throw you a quitting party. There'll be snacks and drinks. Huh. Okay. Sounds good. Great. Then good night. Good night. Oh no. <sighs> it's not like she's wrong about it being fraud, but I don't know. I already promised mom I'd take care of things too. Kill her. But, but, uh, I just don't know. It's not long after Ivy has gone that there's another knock at the door. Well, here goes. <laughs> Hi, Yule. You didn't stick to the plan. Of course he knows, man. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Oh, that's my bad. <laughs> I, I heard that out loud. <laughs> How do you know? <laughs> because I just saw Ivy leave. Alone. Didn't I tell you? Uh, uh, didn't I tell you not to try and explain yourself? Listen, Yule, I, I think you should just leave. Okay, stand on business. <laughs> now, that's a statement one wants to hear an explanation for. 
I've decided I'm not gonna steal the spheres from Ivy. That's... No. I already told her about you. What was that? Oh no. I can't help you, and you don't have to help me. So let's just call it- let's, uh. So let's just call it quits here. Hmm. Noel expects him to blow up at her. To scream and get violent. Maybe wreck the rest of the house too. Why not? What's wrong? Huh? What? You're not angry? Of course not. You're just looking out for yourself. Why would I be mad about that? I'm not Ivy. Oh! <laughs> mm. This guy's quick with it. Ah, uh, he's smart. He's a smart man. Oh. But given that you're supposedly doing what you want right now, what's with the frown? It's just... I don't know. I just wanted to stay honest with her. Like, maybe that was gonna help something, but she just... Just completely refuses to see how screwed I am. I can't just pull money out of my pockets. Who's gonna say ass? Respect that. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so, what did Ivy say after you told her the letter was written by me? Uh, oh my god, he's so smart. <laughs> <laughs> now he's gonna have ammo to blackmail her because she did not mention that. Oh, I see. That's some mighty selective honesty there. She wouldn't talk to me otherwise, and I do want to be friends still. Ah, yes. Friendships and honesty. Two completely unrelated concepts. Don't give me grief over this. I suck. I know. <laughs> I... I'm the worst friend ever. I... <laughs> oh, shit. His eyes look different, do they? Yeah, he's like, fuck. He looks kind of surprised. No, 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 don't say that. Isn't, isn't it Ivy who makes it so you can't be honest? I don't know. Maybe so. <laughs> You'll pet Noel's head. <laughs> there, there. Stop crying. That's a weird. I want to take you somewhere. Abel, would you go? Hey, I'm eventually going to be a prostitute, so what's, that, what's going on? Okay. <laughs> yeah, it is one. It's of late. Indeed. So hurry up and we'll get back before your mom wakes up. Dude, that's crazy. Assuming <gasps> she just didn't. <gasps> Fine. I guess. Damn. She's agreeing? I mean, they're probably not gonna. Mm. They walk into the forest, past the spot where Noel first met Yule. Are you sure you know your way around now? I guess we'll see. Where are we going anyway? Up there. He points at one of the less steep mountains. Starting to regret my choice of shoes. We're not going that high up. You'll make it. They climb until they reach a crevice. Here we go. That wasn't so bad, was it? Now look over there. At the very back of the place sits a creature. Perfectly still, a faint frost covering it. At first, Noel thinks it's a statue, but further inspection reveals it's an imp, deep frozen in place. What happened to this guy? <laughs> the yikes is crazy. He got sealed away. Well, he probably deserved it. No, actually, he didn't. No? Yule looks away for a bit, as if deep in thought. So this guy here is my friend. Oh. 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 <laughs> then, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be so rude. It's just that, well, you know. Oh, <gasps> It's just that imps, well, you know, eat snow sprites and all. Oh, shit. Right. Well, I'm friends with this one. But anyway, he's the reason I need those spheres from Ivy's place. They're used to unseal him. I didn't know. That's because I didn't tell you. But... Mages don't just go around sealing imps at random. Your friend must have done something. What he did was be at the wrong place at the wrong time. Ivy's mother needed to practice her sealing magic, and my friend happened to be nearby. And, well, look at him now. Isn't she talented? That... sure it was her? I was there, Noelle. Then why didn't you stop her? Or tell someone? To what end? It's just a no-good imp after all. Probably deserved it, right? Aw, don't be sad. Why bring me here? Just to make me feel bad? To persuade you to see our little exchange through to the end. Isn't that obvious? But, like I said, I already told Ivy about you. Just her? No one else? Just her. I don't see how that's a problem. Especially now that you've come clean and all, you can just blame me and get off scot-free. Bring me the spheres, I'll give you the snowflakes. Me and my friend get out of here, and you make your money. Everybody wins. I... Why does it feel like something is still off here? Ivy doesn't want me to stay as an apprentice. If you get your license, are you really an apprentice anymore? She'll still be mad. 
then help me just because. No? So you do want me to clear the trial for you? I just don't know if this is such a good idea. Is that why you're talking to me now? I... You brought me here! You didn't Thank have you to come. Sir. What do you think so far, Abel? About this I'm enjoying this. Development? It's like, uh, she's giving off a uh, Broken Girl vibes type shit. I don't know why. I wonder what the imp looks like. Because clearly they don't look like... Yeah! Same here. I want to know how that nigga look like. Yeah, clearly is they don't ugly? look like snow sprites, you know? Because if not, she would have recognized... Because I'm, I'm, assuming, she immediately I'm assuming Yule looks like normal. like. Yeah. So that means the imps don't look normal. Yeah. I'm back, guys. <clears throat> All right, you ready? Yeah. <coughs> yeah. You want me to turn your head. No, I... Yes, you do. The second you started your unprompted bawling, I knew you wanted me to tell you to do it anyway. You just needed me to give you the go-ahead. So go ahead. I... Do it anyway. Noelle bites her lip. Yes, she should do it. But no, she shouldn't. She glances down at her feet. It's not a nod. It's not. Honest. But Yule takes it as a nod. Good. I'll hold you to it. Let's get out of here before your mom notices you were out all night. Yeah. Yule gestures towards the exit. You first. They get back to the village, and Noelle pretends to sleep for an hour or two. Damn, so she didn't sleep at all? That's crazy. Master Utilanin is already at the workshop, as expected. Coffee? Oh, wait, oh. Coffee? Please? Will you do the trial today? Um, no. Not yet. Why not? Don't stall. We got fit clouds to fill. I, I know, but I just think I need some more practice still. Oh, well. Utilanin pours them both <sighs> some coffee. While Noel dabbles with snowflakes. Crap results, as per usual. So, you're friends with Ivy's dad, right? Yes. Do you know her mom too? Everyone knows her mom. What? She's famous. Oh, that's what you meant. What if, What did she think he meant? <laughs> like she was like a whore, maybe. <laughs> what the hell? Why, why would Noel think Wait, that, Wait, I don't though? think so. Yeah, no, that's what no. I thought originally, but like, that's kind of a, like... On Noelle's part, that's kind of a stretch. Like, what, what do you mean? What else? Uh, so she seals away a lot of imps? Yes, if it misbehaves, she will do that. <laughs> I like how this guy talks. What happens then? The imps just stay st sealed until the end of time? No, no. When an imp repents, the seal comes undone on its own. And, um, if the imp wasn't misbehaving in the first place? Not get sealed then, obviously. But if you do seal one? Why would you ever do that? You don't. But I guess if you were to seal one, and they got nothing to repent, then they never get out. <laughs> wow. Mages have to unseal it then. But why you ask? Want to be a mage? I can't make you because you got no talents. No, no. It's just curious. It's just, I heard Ivy's mother sealed some imp around here, and they have the spheres of it at home. Right. Not sure why the idiot dad keeps that stuff on display. Tell them they'll get stolen one day. It'll be trouble with them. Do you think she'd ever seal someone just for the hell of it? Not a chance. She's a serious person. Yeah. What's the matter today? <laughs> huh? You ask nonsense. You don't try trial. Something on your mind? Speak. Oh. Um. The more I think of that sob story you will fed me, the less it makes sense. First he said those fears belong to him, but now they're needed to unseal his friend. I don't know what he's up to, but Master Yudalainen... Seems convinced Ivy's mother wouldn't seal anyone away for no reason. So whatever you will want with that imp, I don't want to know. Hello, Noel. Anyone home? Huh? Oh, yes. There's actually something I should tell you. Oh, shit. Tell me that. About those snowflakes the other day? I wasn't the one who made them. Mm. Yeah. It was this guy who I just met. He said he'd help me cheat so I could get a license. But I just... I can't do it after all. Cheating. That explains it. I was so confused why the quality changed very drastically. Who was it? He was very good. Someone called Yule. He said he's a Grand Master. Hmm. Don't know any Grand Master by that name. But the snowflakes are Master Quality. Our Master Level Easy. <laughs> why such a scumbag? Man? Makes no sense. Yeah. He said he'd help me if I gave him those spheres from Ivy's house. What the? Why he want them? He wants to unseal this imp sitting on one of the mountains nearby. What? In the Cravens on the small mountain? Yeah. Why do you want to do that? That thing eats children. Oh, shit. So much for being innocent, huh? 
That Yule is bad news. Where is he? He'll probably visit tonight. That seems to be his style. Well, I should also visit. Also, your progress in the trial is now zero. Haha. <laughs> yeah, I figured. Start over. You glad I didn't abandon you? I am. Though I might have to drop out anyway. Due to money issues. Well, if so, spot is open later. Thank you. They finish drinking coffee and Noel quits being an apprentice. At least for now. What if Yule kills the big guy? Shit, I don't know. Uh, the story gets serious here. She goes straight to Ivy's place to tell her all about it. Cheers! Uh, cheers! <laughs> they raise hot chocolate toasts. To my incredible failure as a snowflake maker. You better opportunists. Honestly, <laughs> that was definitely the best opportunity that was ever going to come my way. But, yeah. Now I just need to figure out how to get Yule off my back. Yule? The guy I told you about? Master Yudelainen seemed a little worried too. He said he'd drop by tonight, just in case Yule shows up. Want to come too? Okay. Huh? How about now, Saint Atena? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see what this is about. What does she mean by Ugh. this? Fine. Okay, wait, guys. What um, do you think, Santana? Use your mind. Use your mind's eye. You can't you can't smell the bullshit. I'm you can't asking smell for the context, Abel. I know what it means, but I need the context. What, what, what context we were just playing up until now? Well, if I can see, I'll see. What were you going to say, though, Nia? Um, I was going to say that, like, I get Noel wants to be friends with Ivy, and she told Master Yudelainen because he's probably wise, and, you know, but isn't she kind of, like, stupid? She's telling everybody, bro. <laughs> like, she's having a whole fucking party at her house now. <laughs> but, and, like, wasn't this supposed to be on the low? Like, you know? Yeah, I, I guess, know. I it guess she sense. wanted context on the imp in the mountain, and she got it. And you know, it's definitely useful information to know that that thing eats kids. I mean, yeah. I know he's powerful, but I still think you're only an idiot. The hell? What does she mean by that? As promised, that evening, Master Utilanian shows up. Ivy rolls her eyes for no. Oh, she. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm fucking dumb. It's because she's mad at him for rejecting her. Thanks for coming. I brought a special coffee. Brew for us. Don't tell her what to do. You're not her Wait, what? master anymore. <laughs> she, what the fuck is that? He didn't tell her to do anything. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I thought he said brood it for us, not brew it like as a command. Okay. Mm. Thank you. Wow, this is some fancy coffee. I want to try some right now. <laughs> <laughs> Soon there is coffee in a tense atmosphere. I thought she was going to say, I don't got water. <laughs> I don't got water. <laughs> you got to bring the water too. <laughs> Pipes are burning. <laughs> So, what do you think of this coffee? What flavor? It's wonderful. Wonderful, not a flavor. What flavor? Noel takes another sip. Mm, chocolate? Kind of. It's mocha. <laughs> 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 That's right. We taste mocha chocolate flavor. That's actually kind of funny. <laughs> well, I this is you. He coming or not? I don't know. I thought he might. Oh, it's good. <laughs> It's because Noel's too broke to ever afford mocha. <laughs> That's why she didn't know what the hell it was. <laughs> That's crazy. What are you going to do if he does? I don't know. I will see. Great plan. Why are you so snark me with me? <laughs> Dad must whoop your ass a little too. Oh, wait. Dad must whoop your ass too little. That's <laughs> crazy. Why, you stupid um? The kids are trying to sleep. Can you keep it civil? Just in time. There's a knock at the door. Master opens it before Noel gets the chance. Good evening. Hi? Negative. Oh, dude, your pause was way too long. <laughs> yeah. I thought you actually, I thought I was about to be like, hey, it didn't pay bro, you was up, bro. Counting the, <laughs> bro was counting the dots. <laughs> <laughs> I was counting the dots. 